today. We see if we can beat Risk of Rain 2 while every item we pick up is multiplied by a thousand. This idea was originally inspired by Silly Goose Gaming. We have a couple of videos together on my channel. His link is in the description. Go check out his stuff. He is doing awesome work. We pick up one goat hoof, that's a thousand goat hoofs. We pick up one ATG, that's a thousand ATGs. Can we beat the game or will we break it? Let's jump right in and find out. We are playing as Mercenary today for this challenge. I figured uh, Mercenary would be a pretty fun character. We got a lot of mobility, a lot of attack speed, a pretty just like dynamic character overall. So let's see how it goes. As I said earlier, we do pick up 1,000 of every item we pick up. So we have to be somewhat careful about what items we end up taking off the ground. And our first item is a sticky bomb. We now have a 1,000 sticky bombs. That should mean that every single attack <laughs> spawns a sticky bomb. I see a most beautiful focus crystal in that multi-shop. That is gonna, I would imagine. Let us insta-kill almost anything at this point. Uh, okay, well, we get to see it right there. <laughs> we simply do 4,000 damage to every enemy immediately. We could probably beat the game like this, but the goal is not simply to beat the game today. The goal is to borderline break it. Unfortunately, the drones do not get multiplied by a thousand. If I were to do that, the run would now be over. <laughs> My computer, I don't think any computer, could handle a thousand drones on the screen at the same time, all doing individual activities. So that is not included in our run today. The next item we have. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, that's not good news for all the other enemies here. I do want to try a war banner. Let's sub in one focus crystal for a quick thousand war banners. So when we level up, the entire field will be covered by war banner. So we leveled up. And I, and I don't, I see the banner, right? He's, he's right here. <laughs> I don't see the edge of the banner. I think it does cover the whole map. See a little yellow dot on me. That means I am affected by the war banner buff. So I think it's just the entire map. We got, uh oh. Oh, our attack speed just got a little faster. Let's try it on the air. <laughs> There's no way. Look, look at him go. <laughs> <laughs> this array happens in half a second. Let's check out our normal attack speed on a golem. Okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that checks out. That that makes uh, that makes sense. Yeah. Okay. And we get uh oh. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Okay, but if we sprint. Ooh! <laughs> we we move. Ooh! Okay, we can oh. Ooh, ooh. We don't have any way to stop moving, so we may have made a mistake by picking that up. But we can still walk at a very normal pace, nothing is wrong. Uh, okay, we'll grab it. <laughs> oh, there is another equipment here though. I'm gonna open this and test if the dash completely ruins the game. Gubo, I don't want to do. I think that'll ruin the game and I'm scared. Let's try one normal dash. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. A dash has proved fatal. Amazing. So let's let's try it again. This time knowing the pure power of what we're dealing with here. Here we go, our second item of the good run. Uh-oh. I I do feel like we've made a mistake here. Here we go. This is going to be the run where there simply are no issues and everything is wonderful. We've learned what works, we've learned what doesn't, and we'll start off with an equipment. Sawmerang. I, I don't think damage is going to be an issue in this run, but having an equipment is always a good time. For our first item of the 1000 run, we have Stun Grenade. That pretty much means a guaranteed stun on every hit, but that's okay, that's a pretty good start. Our second item, we have teddies. We should be pretty much guaranteed to block all incoming damage. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. 
that, that'll work pretty well. And our next item is crit glasses. We now have a hundred percent chance to crit. Technically a thousand. No. <laughs> Ten thousand chance to crit. Uh, I don't think we'll need that much chance because that's not how percentages work, but I think we're good either way. Our next item is an opal. I don't, I can't remember how opals stack. I'll be honest, I'm not 100% sure how opals stack. I don't know if it's a time thing or a damage reduction thing, but we have a thousand of them now. An elixir. Now, in case the teddy somehow fail, we now have a thousand free lives and the golem is stunned. Our next item is a red whip. Uh, we will not be touching that in the slightest. We, <laughs> I will, our game will break if we grab movement speed like that. Gore's Tome. Now we should just get money all of the time. Oddly enough, our build is not yet broken on the damage front. We're very beefy, but this will just kind of be like a wandering vagrant fight with a little bit of crit, to be honest. There we go. We got a hapu feather. Now we can simply jump <laughs> as much as we want. We now have a pillar escape. He looks really dumb using this many feathers because <laughs> he does a somersault every time. Look at all the gore's tome drops from every enemy we kill. Mr. Gollum, I hear you over here. Uh, goodbye. Thank you for your monies, a bison steak printer. It wouldn't be a Trendomanto video if it wasn't a bison steak, bison steak printer. I'll cut you a deal, I'll cut you a deal, okay? I hate these things. Bison steak, worst item in the game. Go talk to Silly Goose about bison steak, okay? But if I grab one of these, you all have to subscribe right now. You have to do it. You have to go click subscribe. You have to do it, you have to subscribe now. Now I have <laughs> 25,000 health. A thousand watches. Yeah, there's the damage. We should one-shot everything. I don't know how much damage we do. We'll find out on the singular swipe. Uh, 17k. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah, no, sure. Okay, that'll be 17k. And now it's... <laughs> 13 million damage on the first normal swing. The run has ended. Let's see how crazy we can get it. Infusion. Okay, so that's not going to do much. Infusion is not going to help us very much. Let's grab a personal shield generator. I'm going to need to take a look at my health. Take a look at my health. There it goes. <laughs> oh my god. That is 2 million health. We can never die. Fireworks, we're not touching. We're not touching fireworks. That'll ruin the game. We can't click it. And also, I look, fireworks, very fun to pick up. However, the noise, very loud and annoying. You guys, trust me, you guys don't want it. You think you do, you don't want it. And we got a thousand more hapu feathers. All right, teleporter should be uh, as simple as it gets. Let's, uh, let's just do one of these <laughs> for 11 million damage. Shurikens, sure. Look at the number in the bottom left, go. We'll just shuriken every single swipe. We have a thousand, we might have 3,000 shurikens, isn't it three per? No, it's just a thousand, I think. Now we just have shurikens firing on every single one of our throws. So I just wanna show you guys our dash attack does 75 million damage attack speed let's do that now let's take a look <laughs> look at the shurikens go <laughs> go shurikens oh my goodness we do 998 million damage that is so loud too fireworks i'm not picking you up dude i appreciate it i love you fireworks i really do but I j it just can't be done it cannot be picked up wax quail okay uh, wait, okay but just for the meme, we have to do it. Let's see from here. Whoa! <laughs> oh my goodness. Wax quail. And an ignition tank. If we can find a gasoline that is most certainly worth it. Let's just jump over here. Oh, we're over here now. Let me do new so we can get a couple legendary items up in here. Med kit. That'll keep us alive for even longer than we are now. 
Okay, I feel like we are probably strong enough to do teleporter and we will get enough money by the end to get all the items. Let's see how this goes. Z construct, this is gonna feel incredible. Get out of here! <laughs> Oh, more shurikens? Yes, please. Shurikens everywhere! Alright, in this multi-shop, I think we gotta grab a Zephocus Crystal. Oh, uh, why not grab a thousand more elixirs? That that simply couldn't hurt. Will-O-Wisp? I actually wonder what... Oh, oops. I wonder what this is gonna look like. If I uh, just kill one guy, what does the explosion look like? Oh, 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 yeah, I, okay, oh, I gotcha, yeah, no, oh, oh okay. yeah, mm-hmm, okay, that, that makes sense, yeah, 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 a backup mag, we now have a thousand of the little spins, but, uh, hello, 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 <laughs> it's too fast, we, physically, there's no animation left, that's incredible, so, so after afterburner is gonna be one of them. Now we have like a thousand uses of our dash, and we'll grab a Krona bottle too because I mean, come on, come on. Usually you are simply too strong for me, but today I simply win. <laughs> the newt has been defeated. Oh, I I see what looks to be an ATG in front. Oh. Okay, so I gotta remember. E everything dies when I do that. <laughs> That's an important part of the run. Everything on the map dies when I kill an enemy. Let's go rock teleporter because I think we'll get enough money for everything on the map once this is over with Gore's Tomes. Imp Overlord, what's going on, my dude? I'm going to kill this imp and everything's going to die. Bang! <laughs> Look at it go. That's crazy. And a Shatter Spleen for our item. I'll be honest, I forget how stacking Shatter Spleen works, but I'm seeing a lot of explosions. Now we loot around the stage, Topaz, Bridge, you betcha. A Bandolier for infinite skills. I don't really know if we need infinite skills, because we're kind of already there, but it doesn't hurt the run. Armor piercing rounds. I think we have maxed out our damage, but we'll grab it anyway. And... Because it's a Trentomento video, we gotta get cautious, uh. Let's see if we can't take on the gamer chest and get something good. So, I don't know why I did that. We're, <laughs> we're not picking that up. <laughs> our, our run ends if I pick that up. It's just that I have it, I swear. More Topaz brooches, sure, why not? Okay, so I found something interesting. If I spam my secondary ability, we just do this. <laughs> I don't know what is happening, but but this is what we're doing. The secondary ability happens too fast. The game cannot even register the animation. War banner, yeah. Yeah, we'll take full map war banner. Why not? Gasoline is going to go crazy, and predatory instincts is going to go just as crazy. Our legendary chest, what are you giving me today? Soulbound. Okay, that's pretty boring. We don't even have an equipment, and if we did, we wouldn't really be using it, but it's cool. Okay, so see the grandparent over here? We're gonna hit this guy once, and the grandparent is gonna die. Yeah. Yup. Yeah, everything died. Ev yeah, okay. It's all It's all over. Oh, we got the ice band? I, I genuinely wonder, if the game didn't have a damage cap, what would we be at? Okay, now we have to get an equipment. Now we have to. We have a thousand of them. We got another crowbar. Our damage could not get crazier. <gasps> we got a red. I don't know what it was. And we got something else. Let's go find out what we got as our items here. We got Head Stomper and War Banner. Sticky Bomb as... Whoopsie daisies. Okay. <laughs> Sticky Bomb as an item is incredible as well. Okay, so the vase... Oh! So if you look on the right hand side of your screen, you'll see we have 255 vases, uh, which we actually, there we go. <laughs> we can just draw with the vases. That's a lot of vases. Let me grab this beautiful void item. This could be delicious. Needle tick is not delicious, but we did get one. <laughs> So, so void items do not, unless we can get the normal variant. So we're looking for a bleed if we can. We got 
the mocha. Now the question is, does this ruin our run if we pick it up? I do not think so. I think this is still, okay. It is still manageable. Because we have head stop, we can come back down. We just have to like really nicely, look, look at how slow we can go. I'm on a controller, so I can just do this. Look, look at how nice this is. We'll just, we'll just simply walk around the map very peacefully. Don't push very hard on the controller button. Very nice. Yes, Mr. Mr. Mercenary Man. Very kindly. Grandparent. No grandparent. <laughs> More Gore's Tomes. So I know it looks like I'm probably not playing the actual game. But interestingly enough, like, I... I use a mod. It looks like this for for screenshots and you can put on no clip, but we don't have no clip on. We're just this fast. <laughs> this is incredible. And we found another vo another void cradle at the very last second. What do we get? Plasma shrimp. We have a thousand plasma shrimp, though I don't think we'll get a chance to use it. All right, let's very slowly just wiggle our way here and we're out. We're going to the moon, baby. All right, so we all understand the speed here, but if I push my controller all the way forward, I want to see how quickly we can get through the tunnel. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go! Oh, we hit the ceiling. Go! <laughs> and we are at soups. Oh, what is this? Yep, 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 yep. Now we have a thousand pocket ICBMs. I don't even know if that stacks, to be completely honest with you, but now we have it. We already have the hard light, which means we can, okay. So I've realized an issue. <laughs> that speed is a little much for us. Now we begin the long trek up. <laughs> it's this is the dumbest thing you've ever seen in your entire life. We're just, we're getting up there. We have 3,000 jumps. Look at how dumb he looks. What, what is he doing? What is this little guy doing? Ew, it's kind of gross. I'm kind of freaked out by it. And the most intimidating thing you've ever seen. Hello, Mythrix. <laughs> just standing right next to it. So, Mythrix, I want to I wanna explain something to you. I want to explain what's happening here. Yeah, so what's what's going on here is that I am uh, stronger than usual. I, I understand we've met uh, many times before, but there's a difference this time, and the difference is this. So, during phase three, I think we should talk about this. Let's kill this guy. This phase is over. <laughs> okay, so Mythrix, look, you saw what just happened, right? I, th I think we we can probably talk about this. We can we can come up with some sort of like game plan to be friends. No, okay, that works. Oh <laughs> uh, hey, I figured out a problem. I figured out a problem. Uh oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Um, um, wait. Uh oh, wait a minute. Um, I'm gonna have to rely on eviscerate here to not. Oh no. Get him! Do as much damage as we can! Get him! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. Wait! Oh! <laughs> he? Okay. So he's still alive. But I have... 10... Oh! <laughs> I don't know what happened! Look at our items! Mythrix instantly killed us. Our damage dealt? Are you kidding me? Well... No voiding for you all today. <laughs> there was no way we were getting there with 10 that No. <gasps> That's a million. Look at our items. We have a million of different items. No wonder we can't go on. I hope you guys enjoyed the insanity that was that run. Once again, if you enjoyed, uh, go watch some other videos. I got a lot of other mod and stuff. It's a lot of fun. But with that being said, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time.